YouTube, what's up? This your man, Big B Productions 100, and I got a cool new video for you today. We're going to be going over this application I just downloaded out of the Mac App Store, and it goes by the name of Folders Factory. So let's jump right into it. Uh, so my trackpad. I think my battery is getting kind of low. All right, cool. This is Folders Factory right here. You present it with this cool little box right here, whatever. You can either click to play the little short tutorial that they have for you, or you can just close that out and go ahead and get started with yourself. So as you see right here, it says design and create your own amazing folders. So we're gonna close that out and we're gonna play with this a little bit now. This is my second time messing around with this application. I just downloaded this about like 30 minutes ago and I was like, you know what I'm saying? Let me go ahead and jump right into it with a short, with a short tutorial, whatever. So, uh, what we're gonna do is you can change the image, uh, you can do a stand and all of that good stuff. So, we're gonna do the uh, text first, we're gonna play around with the text and the image and all that. So, kind of make this kind of quick. We're gonna change the name to Big B. You want to have Big B on your folder, whatever, or you want to change it to your own name, that's cool. You can change the contrast, you know, light, dark, or whatever, it don't matter. Uh, we're gonna do some uh, fonts. You want to change the different fonts, you can do all that good stuff to try and legacy, whatever type of fonts you have on your computer, blah, 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 whatever. I think that's real cool. We're going to keep this simple font right here. Special characters and good stuff. You want to add all that to it or whatever you can. Different symbols, whatever you have on your computer, smiley faces and everything. We won't do that. That's kind of gay. So we ain't going to add none of that. We're going to keep it just big B. What we're going to do is, oh, you can change the scale size. You want to have it small to big. We're going to keep it big. Folder, you can change the color. I like this feature. Any just color just you like, such as black, blue, brown, whatever you got, we're going to keep it black. Let me see. You can use custom colors if you have any. We're going to keep it as is. So that's pretty much it as far as what the text goes and everything. The rotation, you can rotate it to any position you want. Like I say, uh, it's, it's a lot of applications out here that will do this for you, but by far, I think this is probably one of the best ones they have that I've seen so far. So, I don't know. It may be something like that that you guys have played with or actually have on your computer. And maybe you want to try this out, you know, for $3. I mean, if you got it or whatever, it ain't number $3. So, I, I think you should give it a shot. Try it out. Uh, let's just say if you wanted to add an image to your folder, you want to just take the image, drop it. It's a picture of me and my son. We was at uh, downtown last week just chilling out you know uh, play around with it as much as you want or whatever to it's like ho however you like it you want the little background or whatever the radius you can change that offset or whatever a little darker the gloom effect I like this change that play around with that a little bit uh, the scale like I said you want it big or small it don't matter we're gonna change the color uh, you can change it to green, orange, I guess, to match my son's shirt. Uh, we can keep it, you can change it to white. And we'll just keep it black, you know what I'm saying? So, like I said, the name of this application is called Folders Factory. And like I said, uh, you guys should head on over to the Mac App Store and uh, give it a shot, you know what I'm saying? Real cool. And once you get through making your fold and everything, the folder that you got, and you like it, let's just say, okay, we're going to create a new folder. Uh, what am I doing? You want to create a new folder. All right, once you got that folder, just take it and drop it on top. And there you go. It's done. And that's your new folder. So that can sit on your desktop or you can put it inside one of your. You can put it inside your finder here and add it to your rest of your folders or just keep it on your desktop or whatever. I'm not going to do that because. I hate a cluttered desktop. I don't like to have anything on my desktop. And if it is something on my desktop, you best to believe for sure it's going to be hidden, such as my folders here. So these folders right here that you see on my desktop, such as my Macintosh HD, Time Machine, my external movies and music and all that good stuff. And uh, I got a separate external hard drive hooked up. That's another terabyte. And I, got, I have a, another external hard drive. That's a terabyte as well. I'm gonna be changing all those folders once I get through with this video. So, like I said, I hate a cluttered desktop. So, we're gonna close that down. So, like I said, uh, you guys should go ahead over there and check it out. Create you some cool folders or whatever. 
for your Mac and everything, you know? Because I know you like me and you guys get tired of looking at all those folders and everything. The, the plain folders that they give you. Or, like I said, maybe you guys already have some applications that'll do this for you. But me personally, I like this one. So this your man, Big B Production 100. Be sure to rate, comment, subscribe on this video. You know what I'm saying? Like I always say in my videos, you want to hit me up with any questions or whatever about anything. Uh, holla at me, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to be sure to put up some more videos sometime this week uh, on how to do some cool new stuff inside Mac OS X Lion. I'm going to also put up some new videos as far as me making beats and everything. I'm trying to change my whole style around. So I like to make my beats like for movies or whatever, movie scores and stuff like that. So you guys probably already noticed if you checked out some of my previous videos. If not, be sure to head on over to my other website which is www.ub2.com slash bigbproductions100. So check it out. Follow me on Twitter, twitter.com slash iAppleOSX. This your man. Holla.